Yeah. Earlier in the week, he became the first two-time winner with his back-to-back -back win of the 35th annual Raytheon Map Counts National Championship, which is amazing. That's right. We met him last year here, and we are super proud to have him back for a rematch where we will kick his butt. Please welcome mathlete Luke Robitaille. <laughs> No one's ever done that before. One, two, back to back. That's right. One plus one is a two. Yeah. How, how We've much? We've been working on it. How much scholarship money did you win total? This year I won twenty thousand dollars for first place, plus some other scholarship money, twenty five hundred for being on the winning team, and two thousand for being for winning the written competition. So the total is. How much is, is that all together? Twenty four thousand five hundred. Okay. Just checking. Just checking. He's warmed up. So you can only use that, you can only use that for education, That's right? That's for college. Right. Mm. And I won that same amount last year, and I won $9,500 two years ago, bringing it to a grand total of $58,500. That is correct. Wow. That's correct. What, are you, what grade are you in now? Eighth. Eighth, Eighth grade. grade. You'll be in college in no time. Are you right. thinking about what you want to do after college? So I'll probably go on to, I'll major in math, probably, and then probably go on to get a math PhD, and then likely be some, a math professor doing research, teaching at a university, but who knows, maybe a career in politics. Oh. Politics? Would you want to be? You're going to use your math brain for politics? I mean, he can, can solve the, the fi He can fix it. The stuff. What, would you be pre want to be president? Maybe. Wow. Why not? Hey, why not? Why not you? OK. You know, Year we had a ringer in the audience. Do you remember? We had Mr. Cooper here. He was a math teacher. He was in our audience. Take a look at Mr. Cooper. Well, what is it? Uh, I, I thought really... you had it. No, I, I don't know. Cooper! Uh, are we sure that Mr. Cooper is really a math teacher? Not sure. Let's switch it. All right, go ahead. You take it. <laughs> Switching. We got it. We got it. Let's try 12. 12 is right. Yeah. Thanks for waking up, Mr. Cooper. <laughs> uh, it, it turns out he wasn't uh, much help in that early rounds there. Do you think we need another Mr. Cooper? We do, do need another again? Mr. Cooper. You know what? I've got a great idea. Let's bring Mr. Cooper back. The Come original. On, Mr. Cooper. Mr. Cooper. There he is. Remember Mr. Cooper? Hi, Luke. Good to see you. All right, now this time. Hi, Mr. Cooper. Hi, Mr. Cooper. Hi, Mr. Cooper. Hi, Mr. Cooper, do you remember me? You Kelly. were absolutely yes. no help to me last year. So, uh, you, have you been brushing up? You're warm? I did practice this time. Good. A okay, little. good, because we, we need that. Good, he, good. Here's how the math challenge is going to work. Just like last year, once the equation has been completely revealed by Tony Pig, we can ring in with the answer. The team with the most correct answers will win. All right, guys? That's right. And the winner of our math challenge will go home with. <laughs> What do we Life's get? Life's prestigious golden calculator oh, trophy. Oh, there she is, right there. Hey, uh, there she is. Look at that. Hey, no, all right, it's okay. you against all you of against us. You against the three of all us, right. okay? Just to be right. fair. Okay, here we go. Tony, we're all set. Let's begin. All right, here's question number one. A prize of $900 is to be shared in the ratio of two to one to one among three awardees. How many dollars are in the smallest share? Uh, uh, is it time? You, you take it. Uh, $225? Correct. Yes. What? Nice. Wow. Yes. Here's number two. Okay. Okay. If f of the x equals 3x plus 4 and g of the x equals 2x minus 4, what is f of g of negative 8? Yes. Negative 56. Correct. <laughs> I don't... Hey, we're tied. Yes. Time. All right, next. What is the positive difference between the sum and product of 17 and 29? Oh. Uh, 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 Kelly. Uh, Yanny. <laughs> you know Incorrect. 447. Luke says 447. Correct. Luke gets it. Yeah, number five. That was my next guess. That was my next guess. I heard Yanny too. Yeah, okay. yeah. You Lola, heard too. Michael, and Joaquin each want to buy a Sunday. Oh. But Lola is four dollars short. Oh. Michael is three dollars short, and Joaquin is a dollar short. That sounds Combined, right. they have exactly enough money to buy one Sunday. 
How many dollars does one Sunday cost? Four. Four. That's correct. Four dollars. A math class has 13 girls and seven boys. If one girl is added to the class, what fraction of the class is now girls? Express your answer as common fraction. Uh, as common said, fraction. Oh, oh, two thirds? Two thirds, what? Two -thirds is correct. Oh, that's it. That's it. All right, come on in. Let's get the tally. Come on. So we're adding up the scores now. This will take us a long yes. time to add the scores. Yes, Luke, uh, another back-to-back -back win, Luke, for you. Here's another trophy to add to your collection. Oh, congratulations, Mr. Cooper. Thank, Thank you, you so much. You redeemed yourself. Thank you. Yes. Thank, Thank, you. Thank you very much. Nice job, if you'd like to know more about anything that goes on here at the show, log on to our website, kellyandryan.com.